Well, a Walnut community is in fear following a home break in that ended with a suspect dead. And today we're learning investigators are now looking for two more suspects for the crime. KCAL 9's Tina Ezzedine went to the neighborhood where a lot of people are nervous right now. Serene views along East Country Hollow Drive in Walnut, but residents are troubled. When I heard someone was killed at the end of the day, it's just like, wow. I mean, that's crazy. I mean, luckily, no one else was hurt. Saturday, sheriff deputies found a burglar inside a home shot dead by the 27-year-old homeowner who first heard noises and then footsteps at 4 in the morning. The suspect was not the only one with a handgun. The homeowner was also armed. There was a gunfight, say investigators. Several shots fired, but only the burglar was hit, found dead by investigators in a bathroom. If you go to others' home, you, you get what you deserve. Investigators say the homeowners have been living here for several years. They also add that it does not appear the suspects forced their way in through the front door or other areas of the home. So exactly how they got inside is not yet clear. Detectives also say that once they got inside of the home to take a look at the crime, they did notice evidence of a burglary. You know, the last few years I've seen a spike in crimes and that has to do with the passage of uh, Proposition 47. Someone did break into this home and stole a water heater when we were looking at places. Now this, a burglary leaving one suspect dead, two others on the run, and a community pleading for peace. In Walnut, Tina Ezzedine, KCAL 9 News.